News now from neighboring Karnataka, where the Pollution Board has managed to track down the errant company that dumped toxic waste in Bangalore's railway backyard last Sunday. The company has been shut down, but as Vasanti Hari Prakash reports, they aren't the last of the polluters. A mysterious chemical appeared quietly and anonymously in their neighborhood on Sunday evening. But there was nothing quiet about the stink. On Thursday, the Pollution Control Board managed to trace the alleged culprits, the Karnataka Chemsin Limited, a bulk drugs manufacturer, and send them a notice. The most hazardous material in that is uh, the bromide compounds and uh, more than that, uh, thallium chloride, uh, which is very toxic. Uh, that's one which causes quite a bit of uh, you know, breathing problem and all that. The State Pollution Control Board has now ordered the company shut under the Environment Protection Act. But for Muniamma and her neighbours in Sri Dampura, the problem is far from over. There are over 140 industries across Karnataka classified as polluting. Many of these dump their waste on the sly. And with pollution laws not being enforced strictly, they get away with it. Climate change talks have recently failed in Copenhagen. But what hope do our children have anyway when companies seek their right to pollute? In Bangalore, with camera person Lokesh, Vasanti Hari Prakash for NDTV.